is here. Assurance is here. Promise is here. Prosperity is here. Health is here. Security is here. Boundary tree has ended. Hopelessness is not part of our dictionary. We are confident people. Unity is here. Diversity is here. Prosperity is here. That's what we come to promote. A nation blessed desire the reward. We, as Nigerians, we are not going to give up. Design air. Design on this cap. It's broken shackle. You break the shackle of poverty, break the shackle of ignorance, break shackle of destruction, Break shackle of failures. Break shackle of the primpo. Break the shackle of destitution. God will bless us. We will break that shackle. We will succeed as Nigerians. <laughs> Ours and the last eight years it's been a party that inherited a troublesome nation under the weight of uncertainty then we preach change of government we got a change but it took over took over the least, the lowest production, 400,000 barrels of oil. The worst pricing and the crude oil. But still, the very determined, focused person was able to bail out even 36 states of this country who are not able to pay salary, who are living in hunger, give him a bravo. It is easy to forget. Very easy to forget. The situation of the country then. Flags flying. Over several local governments in north, east, northwest of Nigeria, he promised, I will stop them there. I will restore hope. He renewed our hope. He did what he promised. He was prudent. Is it easy to forget? That they take you hours and hours between Kaduna and Abuja and Ibadan and Lagos Road. But today we are commissioning them. Our opponents spent 16 years They had forgotten that highway is an economy, that electricity is mandatory for industrialization. They don't even understand the power of transmission line and there's a need for maintenance of it. They, even, they couldn't even make down payment, down payment on retract.
their political party, Jembulas. <laughs> political party of termites. If they say they want a change of government, just tell them, we like to be polite, but shut up your mouth. <laughs> to you women who are gathered here today, I'm so proud so happy. If you leave me alone on this stage, I will talk my excitement, demonstrated my happiness, my joy, my excitement that you are behind, you are way in the front, you are behind, you are in the front, you are ready to fight for us, to vote for us to elevate our life, to build Nigeria. You are great. Say you are great. Greatness is yours. You are beautiful too. God bless you. Thank 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 you. They are. They are in the village of Lunacy. If we think, if they think, a nation is not just built on abusive language and talk at it before. 16 years of rottenness, 16 years of nothingness, 16 years of ditching the whole of independence, of PDP. Never again they shall come back. Never again. Are you assuring me? Are you assuring me? Never again. Never again they'll be back here. Who are they? They are looters. Who are they? They are squanderers. Who are they? They are prisoners and the looters. Go out there. Go out there and tell them a new hope is here. Go and tell them a new hope is there. Whether it's from Imo State, self, we take. Tell them. Today is Women's Day. A lot of women with me of kindness. Tell them, I shall be here today. Now, wow. I'm sure you guys have listened to this man. See all the lights. So I don't know what you can really make up from this, uh, from the speech that this man has just uh, delivered. And you could see the women shouting on top of their voices. Voices, they were just trying to hype the situation. Say shame to all of them. Say shame to all of them. 
say all those ones. They are just shouting, shouting. You, you think it's just for nothing? Majority of them have just already concluded that Nigeria will not be better. The only thing is just for them to be part of a, the ruling party. Let them belong to one political party or the other. They know what to share and what to get for themselves. They are not thinking generally for the whole country. You can imagine. And that is the majority of the Nigerian people. That is their mindset. So far I get my own. So far my family members are okay. You know, the rest of people just go and look for how you're going to survive. With all of the things that we are talking about. You know, I was even saying this the other day that most of this, uh, like all this Aisha uh, Buhari and the governor's wives, they don't even know what the market is talking about. But believe you me, apart from those ones who are sitting on the first row, and you can see that even from their gesture, from the beginning, they were just trying to... Mm, mm. Even the chairman of the party, Abdullahi, he was there. All of them were just like uh, trying to, to cope, let them do what they needed to do and move on. All of them there, they are not even in one accord. Their minds are not even the same. All of them, every one of them thinking of one or two things. Like we said, most of the, most of the women, especially the governor's wives and the president's wives, they don't know what the market is talking about. But the rest ones that are sitting at the back, oh my God, they just go carry all those ones. You see the way they are just shouting, hyping, and what have you. You will remember there was one video that came out when Tinubu was talking about a PVC uh, getting expired, which is not true because they just wanted to be hyping and be shouting on top of their voice to cover up some things. All of them were shouting, "Yes, it is true," and which is not true. The PVC does not get gets it doesn't get expired, but they were shouting, shouting, and shouting and confirming wrong things. What can you make of the speech that this man said? What can, what meaningful thing can you just even talk about? The same lies upon lies. Is he talking about PDP? No, he could not even say anything concerning the 80 years they have spent. But he said everything is fine. That they have done well. They changed the promise. They are telling you that the promise they they made to you, that they fulfilled them. So why you why Nigerians, why Nigerians complaining? So they want to continue. And that's why they always come with this uh, phrase that uh, they are going to start or Tinubu will continue from where. Buhari stop from. That means Nigerians, I don't know whether you are you guys are lying because from what they are saying, they have uh, they have fulfilled the promises. In terms of uh, insecurity, everything is okay now. That is what he's telling you. And on that note, you can continue from where Buhari has stopped. Oh, the 16 years he's still talking about that they didn't bring this, they didn't bring that. Then tell me what we have gained. Tell me what we have gained. These are the people who are talking about uh, it is the turn of the Yoruba. And they have, a lot of people have come out and said, all of you who are saying it is your turn, they don't even know you. Maybe that is what the Northerners are enjoying now. They are enjoying the fact that, uh, yes, Buhari is just there. I think that's all. They, they can go and sleep. They will drink water and then, then go and sleep. They will go and sleep. It's all about our person is there. And that settles it. Then why are you guys complaining? Why are we talking about the unemployment? We are talking about... We are talking about... Uh, the insecurity, why are we talking about how things have gone bad? How foreign investors have left the co this country? Why are we talking about that? Why is it that we cannot get the electricity? Shame on all of them. Like I've always said, I don't blame all this, I don't blame them more. It is people who sit down and listen to them, who still follow them, who still support them, who see campaign for them. Those are the people I blame. I don't blame them. <laughs> why should I blame them? I don't blame them. So they are enjoying the foolishness of majority of the people in Nigeria. So that's why they can continue to, to brag and be talking nonsense. So guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this.